My name is Margaret Schortel and I'm a context curator at the Museum for Islamische Kunst here in Berlin. My specialty is Persian literature and Persian painting from the 15th and 16th centuries. I chose the uh, Safavid youth. I like the tile work because it's a representative object of um, Safavid tile work. In uh, this time period, it would have been in a palace context, um, perhaps a garden context, and it's one of a number of kind of these kinds of images where you have young women, young men who are um, depicted as beauties, roaming through garden spaces. So there's a lot written about diversity and sexual diversity or sexual identity in this time period because some of the, uh, what we today think of strict separations are a little bit more flexible and fluid. In Persian literature, you don't have a term for he, she. You have u, um, that can be either he, she, or it. And so there is a certain gender flexibility in the terminology that the poets could use to refer to either male beloved or a female beloved. Um, and it's not always clear which it is. I like getting the question about diversity in the Museum for Islamic Art um, because in many ways I find Islamic art to embrace diversity wholeheartedly. Uh, it's in the structure of the field, a field that ranges from Spain to China um, and from the 7th century to today. And so diversity is just there.